Hello guys, Nicolas here. Now we will see how to create communication within contracts. We will start with a simple case where both contracts are on the same file, but then we will proceed to create communication with a contract that is already deployed on the blockchain that will enable us to create smart contracts in the future and then create another one more in the future that will be able to communicate from one of the bus that is already written on the blockchain. So we start creating a new document, we call it communication pragma solidity 0.4.0. We call contract color contract. This will be the contract that will call another contract. And the other contract that we will call it's a called contract. We will name this variable to be called and it will be of the type new called contract. Of course, this contract doesn't exist yet. We will have a function to get a number. This number we want to get will be the number that it's deployed on the other contract. So we will return uh, to be called dot get number. This will be a function that will be on the other contract. And here we did make this constant and will returns a uint. It will be an unsigned integer. So we call it contract. Okay, this is of course uh, have an error because we don't have that yet. Now we will create the contract called call it contract. This called contract will have a number will of type UI, UI int number equals 300 number. And this, of course, needs a function. The function we are called calling and the function will be get number and it will be constant and returns a UI int. And this, of course, it will be that simple return number. And that's it. Now we execute the colored contract, colored contract. Then we execute the color contract. And if we get the number, we can see the value of 300. So now we'll make this more interesting. This is the first example, but now let's assume that this contract doesn't exist on this same file. So we need the address. We will copy this address. We will put it here. Then we don't need the new function. And now we can execute the color contract, color contract create, and we we'll still will be able to, to see this value of 300, even though we haven't executed right now the colored contract. So this is very important. You can have like your own library of contracts or your base contracts already deployed on the blockchain, and then you will be able to make much more interesting things without duplicating code because duplicating code is expensive in terms of gas and gas is money because you pay it with Ether. Hope you like it, subscribe it, like it, and I will have more videos coming soon. Bye.